What's going on guys? Today this video is about telling you where you can find old US currency, where I found my US currency, and the best way to find US currency. So let's go ahead and start by the 100. By the way, I did not find a 50 yet, so I do not have that one for this video, but you can find it the same exact way. So this 100, I, it's from the year 1974. I found it. Uh, in my job, a friend of mine had it, and I let him know before, prior to him telling me, that I collect these bills. So he got one from the bank, and then he saved it for me so I could exchange it for 20s, so I could have it. So that's how I found that one. This one, a friend of mine works in Pollo Tropical, which is a restaurant, and he knows I collect them, so he told me, he called me, yo, I have this one, I found it, come exchange it, so I, I went and I exchanged it. This one... I found it in Winn-Dixie as I was in the line paying for some stuff. I saw the, the girl open the cash register and she had it there. So I traded uh, 10 modern dollars for these. This dollar, I actually found it in Puerto Rico. My grandpa gave it to me. So, yeah. This $2 bill, I found that at a bank when I went to exchange some money. And this 5 I found it out of Walgreens so the best way to find US old currency guys is basically just in your normal everyday life going to stores every time I go to a store and I am at the cash register I always ask the person behind the cash register the cashier do you have any old bills that you want to trade that, you, that I could exchange because usually when they're old they put them under the cash uh, the cash register because they um, either don't want to use them or blah, 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 whatever. They think they're fake or whatever. So I always just ask. And the best thing about finding them this way is that you pay face value. You don't pay anything over face value. Face value is when you, let's say, I exchange 20 for 20, right? I don't buy it. Let's say this one, let's say um, they sell these on eBay for like 40 bucks, this old 20 that's paying over face value because I'm, I'm basically losing 20 bucks but getting them this way you're paying 20 for 20 so you're not losing anything and that's great so that's the way that I got my currency and that's the best way of finding old US currency um, you could also go to the bank and just ask them do you have any old bills you know that's the way that I found uh, this other old hundred so you know you could also do that in the same way I found all of these $2 bills, you know, in the bank. So, yep. Hopefully this video helps you guys. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Peace out, guys.